website that's supposed to help Christian singles, quote, find God's match for them. But now a beauty queen is coming forward and accusing a man of using the site for decidedly unspiritual purposes. ABC's Tanya Rivero is here with the story. Good morning. Good morning, Dan. That's right. It took a lot of courage for this beauty queen to come forward and talk with us, speaking out against a man police say targeted women on a religious dating site because he thought they would be easier prey. California beauty queen Victoria Kinney says she feared falling victim to an unholy crime at the hands of this man, Sean Banks, who police say used this Christian dating site to fish for more than just dates. Join ChristianMingle.com today. He was very eloquent, very educated, very smart. There were a few things that he said that were a warning sign to me. Banks stands accused of sexually assaulting another woman he also met on ChristianMingle.com. He began to uh, become more and more aggressive and ultimately led to um, a charge of raping her. Police had trouble tracking him down as the 37-year-old allegedly used aliases to open three accounts. But when they did, Banks was arrested for rape and robbery. Kinney, a Miss California 2012 contestant, says Banks began to threaten her when he got out on bail. He called me letting me know that he had been arrested and um, didn't want me talking to police. Friday, a judge banned Banks from getting within 100 yards of Kinney. Banks has pleaded innocent to all charges. Can you imagine being a young man going on a dating service, thinking things are going well, and then having her make these types of accusations that are misconstrued, that are not correct. Find God's match for you at ChristianMingle.com. Christian Mingle makes it clear the site does not conduct background checks. A spokesperson tells ABC News, we continue to assist police in every way possible. The safety and security of our members is our top priority. And in that courtroom Friday, Banks also faced two additional charges, one involving a previous rape allegation from 2009 and another involving threatening a witness. Banks was taken into custody on a no bail request on the new charges. He will be back in court Wednesday, Dan and Bianca. It really does make you think they don't vet these people. You have to be careful yeah, online, bottom line. All right, Tanya, thanks. thanks.